But I'm going to go visit a slightly more slithery guest that we have here in studio. I'm going to visit our friends at Jack's Parks. Now we have Julie and we also have Garrett in here. Guys, welcome to River City Live. We're so happy to have you. Uh, Garrett, not that I don't love you dearly, but you know I love love a little a little friend over here. Okay, now Julie, tell me who I have here. Sure, so this is Crow. Ooh. She is a black pine snake and she's pretty young. Pretty girl. So uh, she is at our nature center at Tilly K. Fowler Regional mm -hmm. Parks. At Jack's Parks, we have three nature centers around the city at Huguenot Beautiful. Park, Hannah Park, and Tilly K. Fowler Regional Park. We offer free guided hikes, bike tours, kayak tours, uh, and we really want to be your guides to connect you with the local parks that we have. The city of Jacksonville has over 400 parks and preserves. Uh, and we really want to connect people with those public lands because we have amazing wildlife on them. And I think people would be really surprised if they really got out there and explored our parks if you haven't had the opportunity to. Yeah, and this is such a great time of year to do it. Now it's like a little kind of brisk and fall out there. Gary, you guys have a ton of events going on too. So if people aren't sure, just it's not really about just going to get a walk about, but there's so many activations y'all have going on. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, we're really focusing on the downtown area of Jack's. We've got a lot of uh, great parks being built, uh, a lot that are already open, uh, like Friendship Fountain. Um, and so we're activating them. Um, so we're trying to get people out in the parks, trying to uh, get people um, active, being social, learning something new. So uh, we've got free programs of all types. We've got dance classes, art in the park classes. Uh, we've got poi spinning, uh, which is pretty unique. You should look it up. Um, and just a lot, a lot of great community uh, uh, activations and events going on and so uh, you can come join 500 of your closest friends and do <laughs> yoga at Friendship Fountain. Um, you can come this Sunday uh, to a community Friendsgiving event where we've got eight food trucks all of which are offering Thanksgiving themed food um, so that's going to be a great event. We've got community movie nights, um, we, we've got first Fridays at the fountain. Uh, we're, we're just trying to do whatever we can to get people out into the community and use it in our parks. I mean, I think it's so great that you guys are, like you said, really activating some of these spaces that, you know, maybe we just only consider for like a casual hike or walking our dogs. But um, guys, if you can roll like the video and the images that we have here. Oh, yes. Thank you. Close up first. Thank you. Close up first. Um, there are so many things going on. Um, tell me a little bit more about the Friendsgiving that's coming up. Sure. That would be yeah. Garrett's event. Yeah, so uh, this Sunday, obviously, mm, as we mentioned, we're so trying cute. to activate our parks and Friendship Fountain. Um, and so we're trying to do something uh, for every holiday to, to bring people out, give them a, a great a low cost option to participate in. Um, and, and so this was a, an idea that kind of spurred out of nowhere to uh, offer Thanksgiving on the South Bank, on the Riverwalk. And so uh, with that, obviously, I mentioned all the food trucks that are going to be offering Thanksgiving themed foods. Uh, we're going to have uh, the Riverwalk bar set up. So if you wanted to get get a beer or wine, enjoy it during your meal, or walk the river walk through the new program, you can do that. We'll have live music. Adam Cotton, who's a local artist, he's going to be uh, playing for us throughout the event. So we're really looking forward to it. Uh, it's the first one. We're looking to do it every single year and build upon it and really turn it into something cool. Awesome. Well, thank you guys so much for the personalized invite. Now, Julie, if we want to keep up with all the events that are happening, and maybe if we want to go see the meet and greet, I know, do you like my necklace? Where should we where should we find out more info? Sure. So uh, I encourage everyone to visit jacksparks.coj.net. Follow us on Instagram. Follow us on Facebook. Follow us on X Twitter. Um, and really get involved with us. We love introducing people to new wildlife in our parks, new parks, new hikes, uh, kayak tours, bike tours. So please get involved with us. We would love to see you out on the trails. Yes, and I would love to see you because you're such a cutie. All right, guys, stick around with me for a lot more River City Live coming up right after this. See you, bye.